Hey, what's up everybody? Big Ten here with a fresh hobby box in from Tops today. We've got 2023 Tops Heritage Baseball. Could be packed with a real one autograph. So uh, hang tight and we'll find out. Hey, so a special thanks to all of you who are returning today to check out another video. Uh, for those of you who are new to the channel, I'm Big Ten. Uh, we rip sports cards and uh, other trading cards here on the channel, mostly uh, sports though. Uh, but today we got baseball, fresh from tops. Um, got a uh, full hobby box here, 2023 Heritage. We're gonna have 24 packs of nine cards each. And a uh, little thing I found interesting is uh, this is the first product that I've ordered off the tops website and has arrived uh, from Fanatics. Uh, and they guarantee their satisfaction, so we got to get something good, right? It should be uh, interesting to see if uh, you don't pull anything good, what uh, Fanatics would actually do on that. So we do get a box topper here. Uh, it's going to be, uh, looks like we have a original 1974 Tops card stamped with the 50th anniversary. So that's going to be Dell Unser. Um, not familiar with Dell, if you guys know who he is. Or why they uh, still haven't figured out how to cut cards properly in 50 years. Let me know below in the comments. Um, but the odds of that, which I probably should have showed you guys before popping that. Um, if you guys are opening one of your own boxes, those are going to be the odds for the box topper. If I get that to uh, focus properly. So we didn't get anything oversized. But the uh, Tops original was one in every five boxes. So nothing too crazy there. Um... This box does not have the pack odds on there. If you want to see the pack design real quick. Um, it wasn't around in 1974, but I'm guessing that's uh, what the pack design might have looked like in 74. But those are going to be the uh, odds for these packs. If you want to pause and take a longer look, go ahead and do that. Um, and then, of course, if you want to do the uh, postcard to tops to try and get a free hit, uh, that is there as well. So that said, uh, hopefully we didn't take too long to get into this. Hopefully you're still hanging around to see some cards. Maybe click forward. Um, but here we go. Let's take a look. We got the uh, Bobby Witt on the cup card. I'm just going to try to uh, fly through the base here. The nice thing about Heritage is they are finally putting their uh, short prints and rares in uh, backwards. Um, like they do in the normal tops. But we got the uh, new performers for Michael Harris. That's a win. Uh, Jeremy Pena on the cup card as well. And back to Bobby. So we're hoping for uh, some better luck this year with Heritage. Heritage has not been kind to me in the past with uh, big hits or anything. Mark Ventos, rookie. Tavar, rookie. Here we got uh, JJ Blade on the new performance. Francisco Alvarez for the Mets. Let's see what he becomes. But, uh, I think the only mentionable autograph I've pulled out of Heritage, that came from a mega box a couple years back. We got a uh, Carl Yastrzemski. That was pretty big. We got these upside down. Uh, there's my guy Garrett Mitchell. Hopefully he heals up quickly. Uh, wisdom. Sawinski for the Pirates. Another new age performer for Oswaldo Cabrera. Alexis Diaz cup card. Franklin Germain. And uh, the two all-stars there that we started the pack off. Just kind of overlooked that. Looks normal. Just crazy. Uh, Ezekiel Duran, rookie. Tyler O'Neill. Encarnacion. Chavis. New Age Performer for Stephen Kwan. Varland on the rookie. Diaz. Back to Mr. Duran. Here we got uh, John Duran. Kel Rowley. Flores. Gary Sanchez. Carlos Perez on the rookie. We've got something backwards here for uh, Ty France. And let's see what that is going to be. If we can get that to focus. Uh, looks like it's raw. What does that mean? 
Okay. So just the, uh, oh no, maybe not raw. Does this say black and white? It says black and white. The Derek Zoolander Center for Kids Who Can't Read Good. We got the black and white for Ty France. This is going to be one of our short prints there. Uh, Corey Seeker, moving along here. Um, did we skip the rest of the pack there? Maybe not. All right, so I'm curious. I didn't actually read the odds there. What do we got for uh, black and white? Black and white is one in every 205, so not bad. It's one in every nine boxes, roughly. A little uh, quick math. Not the biggest name, but it's all right. Uh, we got Jose Buto. Carlos... What's stuck here? Charlie Blackman, Shane Bieber, Zach Wheeler, Jesse Chavez, O'Neill Cruz, Mr. Profar, and back to the butt. Max Mayer, is it Mayer, Meyer? Hopefully one of you guys will correct me. Teoscar. Fernando, upside down. Nothing special. Um, you know, I do have to go back and look and see if... Uh, oh, there's an auto. Speaking of hits, this is Jose Barrios on the real one auto. I'd like to see that. Decent name. It's, uh, you know, it's a pitcher, but we'll take that. We'll take that all day. Um, yeah, all right guy I actually know um, to be honest I'm not sure how he's been doing up in Toronto but uh, he made a name for himself in uh, Minnesota I know so nice no relic what are the odds of actually pulling that auto we're gonna go back to this real quick all right real one autograph single one in every 113 yeah, so that's uh, just more quick math there. One in every five boxes. So I guess the uh, the autos are rarer than uh, thought. Uh, moving on. Let's see what else we got in this box. Still looking for some chromes. That would be nice. Uh, we got Jeter Downs. Not to overlook uh, the victory at leaders. Let's see if I can get this more centered for you guys. Ian Happ. Some more Teoscar, Will Brennan, George Springer, uh, we got Christian Pache, Kirk, and Kale Mitchell. I think we already saw him. Uh, other possibilities, uh, I believe sitting at one per case is uh, maybe two per case. You can get a hot box, which has a purple chrome variant in every pack. So be on the lookout for those guys. But I've seen one of those ripped so far. Got a nice purple Garrett Mitchell out of it. And a break. Uh, I did not get it myself. Uh, there we go. Nothing too big in that pack. A Nick Senzel. David Villar. Ortega. Cueto. Garrett Colt. Ranger. Uh, we got the 22 World Series Game 1. Josh Rojas, Jesus Aguilar, back to Mr. Senzel. We got uh, Dre Jameson, Aaron Judge, RBI leaders, Palacios, Joey Gallo, Pete, Shamanea, Martin Perez, Ryan Helsley. Great. Tyler Anderson, uh, Bailey Falter, Jose Miranda, Mr. Soto, Eugenio, Brian Shaw, Eric Lauer for the Brew Crew, Kyle Calhoun, Matt Brash. The interesting background, those clouds. Nothing special, but uh, looks cool. Uh, we got the Aaron Judge special. 
These are kind of cool cards. If you haven't seen these yet, this is uh, 2021 and 2022 tops cards on there. Jim Musgrove, Tommy Edmond. Now and then for Catfish and Justin. Matt Liebertor. Oh boy. Throwing cards. It's a PSA 5. Uh, so we threw JT Real Muto on his head. Rich Hill. Uh, Heimer Candelario. Jordan Groshans. Nice Gunnar Henderson rookie. He's a winner. Varsho Yastrzemski. Yeah, now and then, Garrett Cole, Nolan Ryan. And TA7, and Tim Anderson. I wish Tops would use these uh, pack wrappers for all their stuff. It's easy to open. Uh, if you guys were wondering. Byron Buxton, Loriano, Mr. Berger, Nelson Cruz, Seth Brown. Thought I skipped one. Nick Gordon, I did skip one there. Uh, we got Ryan's third no-no back in 1974. It's a cool one. Jared Walsh. Uh, Rope, Mr. Odor. I'm still not sure how to pronounce Rugnid. Uh, going to Mr. Schwarber. Uh, skipped one there. You'll never see the downtown. Tony Kemp. Randy Rosarena. Joey Wendell. Cole Irvin. You say. Uh, we got Rockefeller becomes 41st U.S. President. Javi Baez. Frambert Valdez. And you back to Kyle. You got Alec Manoa. Michael Garcia, rookie. Who is sticking to... Uh, it's going to be Kettle Marte. Why... They come apart. There we go. <laughs> All right, that was tougher than it looked. Kettle Marte. All that for Kettle Marte. Uh, Nicky Lopez. Moving on from that disaster. Evan Longoria. Paul Goldschmidt. Merrill Kelly. And Jeremiah Estrada. And Adrian Morjon. Marco Gonzalez, Glenn Otto, uh, Oscar Gonzalez on the rookie, Julio Urias, Class A, uh, Vinny P on the rookie cup and the rookie card, George Kirby, Ben Attendi, uh, Hayden Wesneski for the Cubbies. Throw up the side for Luke. Luke, Mr. Cub fan in my family. Uh, Jake Cronenworth. Dalton Guthrie on the rookie. Andrew Chafin. Eloy. The gold chain. Um, a guy, Rosario. No idea if I pronounced that right. We got Jordan for the postseason. Uh, we got all-star outfielders for Acuna and Judge. And an Oswaldo Cabrera on the rookie. Nice. Um, but Ryan McMahon. I like to think I have a decent idea of what we're looking for in here, but uh, you never know. This stuff is fairly easy to uh, look over hits. everywhere here um afterwards i'm gonna go back and look and see if i missed any high number short prints as well and we'll uh kind of do that as a little recap because uh we've gone too far to go back and look right now uh we got sunny gray though bryce mitch more judge special this time for 2017 of his rookie on there and his cup card. It's a nice one. 
Uh, James Outman for the Dodgers. Keegan. Brian Bello. Uh, Nuster Cortez. Max Stasi. And back to Sonny. Uh, so we got three packs to go here. Let's pop them out of the box. See if we can get some last bag magic. Uh, Eric Hosmer. Uh, one of my favorite guys, Dan Vogelbach. Christian Walker. Alex Call on the rookie. Uh, Kiner Falafel. Yes, I know I pronounced that wrong. Uh, Emmanuel Rivera. Shohei. Uh, weird thing about Shohei, or I guess all the Angels, is uh, they don't have their uh, city name on the cards. Just to shout that out. It's not a short print, not a mistake. Just ease with the tease. We got Colton Wong. Marcana. Uh, G1 by. Not familiar with him. Uh, nice rookie for him. Uh, we got AL postseason for a game five homer. Apologies, I'm not sure who that is in there. Uh, Cody Bellinger, uh, Randall Grichik. Back to Colton. Colton setting us up for some last back magic here before we go back and look for. Uh, some high numbers, which I won't make you sit through. If you've stuck around this long, thank you. I always appreciate you guys uh, watching the full video. Still no color or chrome. I guess we uh, had to pay for getting a real one auto. DJ LeMayhew, Lane Thomas, Giancarlo, Kohei, Dom Smith, Miles Mikolas, with the fantastic stash. Edmund Sosa. Uh, Gabe Moreno on the rookie. Anthony Santander. And back to DJ. So yeah, that was uh, crazy. We got the real one auto, but that was like it. Yikes. Uh, so hang tight. I'm going to go through that entire stack and see uh, if I missed anything. All right, went back and figured all that out. Uh, did have eight short prints. Uh, the high number variety. Uh, for those of you not familiar with Heritage and their short prints, uh, all you're looking for in the 500 card set is anything over the number 400. Uh, also figured out if you're looking at the backs, the high numbers are gonna be a little darker on the back. Uh, I'm not sure if that was intended or not by Tops, or maybe they, uh, I don't know, used a different card stock for the high number on accident. Uh, but going through them real quick, if you're interested, we had uh, Emmanuel Rivera, was a short print. Uh, Edmundo Sosa, Brian Shaw, uh, Matt Theis, Sean Manea. And then it looks like all these uh, postseason ones are going to be short prints as well. So let's uh, go through those real quick, including the World Series one. Uh, so I don't know. Uh, we did get the real one auto. We got the black and white Thai France. And we got all the uh, guaranteed, well, not guaranteed, but the uh, based on the odds, every one in three packs. We got all eight high number cards. So um, good job, Fanatics. Satisfaction guaranteed. You, uh, you hit the mark. Um, not the greatest box, but it's all right. Can't win them all. Jose Barrios, Real One Auto. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm Big Ten. I'll see you in the next one. I'm out.